In the Heart of the Word, Reflections by Father Joseph Mary, S.E.T.J.M. On the Daily Readings from the Holy Mass Wednesday of the third week of Easter God bless you, dear family. Today in the Heart of the Word, we hear the first of the seven I Am statements in the Gospel of John. Since God revealed His name to Moses in Exodus chapter 3, I am who am, the phrase I am was not spoken by the Jewish people so as not to tarnish the name of God. Remember that seven symbolizes perfection. Jesus therefore not only says the divine name, but He reveals that He is the fullness of that name with seven definitions. These are the seven I am statements of the Gospel of John. 1. I am the bread of life. John chapter 6, verse 35. Just as God gave manna in the desert, so Jesus gives us the Holy Eucharist to sustain us in our journey to the promised land, which is God himself. 2. I am the light of the world. John chapter 8, verse 12. To a world in darkness, Jesus is the light of life. 3. I am the gate. John chapter 10, verse 7. Jesus is the only way to the Father. He is the Savior of the world, and He keeps out what should not enter, and He lets in the ones that the Father desires. 4. I am the resurrection and the life. John chapter 11, verse 25. Death is not the final word for the Christian. By faith and baptism, we already rise with Him. Death, where is your victory? For nothing can separate us from the love of God in Christ Jesus our Lord. Amen. 5. I am the Good Shepherd. John chapter 10, verse 11. Jesus keeps out the wolves and he protects his lambs. He lays down his life for us on the cross and every day in the Eucharist so that we may have life in abundance. 6. I am the way, the truth, and the life. John chapter 14, verse 6. In a world of deception and self-referentiality, Jesus reveals to us the truth about the human person and the Father's love. He calls us to renounce comfortable compromises and to walk the necessary path of conversion, which may be painful at times, but promises true and lasting peace and happiness. 7. I am the true vine. John chapter 15, verse 1. No matter how difficult life may be, Jesus is with us. And not only is He with us, He is in us, and we are in Him. We are one body in Christ. We are one vine in Christ. Let us listen to these words of Mother Adela. Our Lady teaches us that to be truly disciples of her Son, we must sit in the school of the Gospel and listen, treasure, guard, and cultivate in the fertile soil of our hearts, each word, each gesture, each act, and every definition. For only Christ has the words of everlasting life. All for the heart of Jesus, through the heart of Mary. Alleluia.